So now this problem says a 30 year loan is arranged to pay off loan taken out today at 5% annual effective rate. First payment of the end due is due in 10 years, right? So it's due in 10 years in an amount of 1,000 and each subsequent payment increased by 500. So I'm guessing that this 30 year annuity ends times 40 and we want to find what the present value of this whole spiel is to find out what the loan is at time equals zero. So we can use the PQTVM PQ formula so we can set the payment amount to equal to P plus Q for I which is the first payment in the sequence, a thousand, which is denoted P plus the increase denoted Q over the effective interest rate of 5%. And now we can solve. We can do 500 divided by 0 0.05 plus 1,000. We can get 11,000. Then for the future value, we can do negative Q and I equals negative increase of 500 30 number of years 0 0.05 we could get negative 300,000 then we said number of years 30 I to the Y 5% now we just solve for P, B, present value in the calculator. So I'm going to take my calculator. I'm going to set it to 11,000 as the payment, 300,000 as the PJ value, as the number of years, 5% interest rate, new present value. It's going to be 9963. Point seventy three. Now we want we notice that it's deferred ten years, so we want to discount it back to zero at five percent. So we notice here that the first payment occurs at a thousand. We're going to use nine as the comparison date for this whole uh, PQTBM that we solved, right? So now that means that from time nine, we discount it back for nine years. We're going to get one point zero five to the nine. So while we take our calculator, we do 99683 times 73, 1.05 to the negative 1. And we end up getting 64257.02, which is D.